Okay, I had been trying to live stream and it just wound up cutting out and having issues. So I had kind of been mentioning about doing it this way anyways, just because from what I had seen in the live stream videos, the quality was not very good. So I think it was cutting out when I was trying to say, but I'm going to see about trying to do uh, just recording it live like this and then have it upload uh, during the race and then it can hopefully be seen later on in the night or uh, tonight after the races are finished so yeah it was just being kind of weird plus honestly the stabilization is much better this way so got our concessions out here again now, who are you guys out here with again? That's the county sheriff's posse. The sheriff's posse. All right. Thank you. Well, we definitely appreciate our law enforcement in that. So, glad seeing you guys out here. Appreciate the donations. Well, yeah, glad to see you guys out. Hopefully, see you guys again. Got your food even covered while you're out here. Come out. Have some fun with the family. So, I've seen a couple kiddos running around out here too. I mean, heck, there's, I think it's that, I think it's that many right there, I believe, I could be wrong, but I believe that was the one that she took a ride along with another racer. That racer wound up winning their main event with her in the car, and she wound up getting a car the next race. So I believe that's who that is. And so I'm pretty sure it's going to be a young gal, probably in her teens that's doing that so definitely can say it's definitely a family sport Greenville strong <clears throat> Definitely glad to see some support coming out here for them. Definitely devastating what happened out there. Gee, that trailer looks familiar. It's got a different car out the back of it. Looks like Matt Canada, maybe. I think that is Matt Canada over here making a bunch of noise. Modifieds. Kennemore Racing Team. Some more minis. Clean looking minis. Okay, here's your pop quiz from the last race. Comment down below who's driving that mod. Double points if you can name where she got the mod from. There's a little hint for you. Got some more stocks. Sport mod down there. I think I see a trouble. <laughs> Cheyenne used to work with her. Fun days. <laughs> Can more cars out here? Modifieds. A nice new one, clean. Another nice clean looking one. Got the Hulk out here. So any idea when your bat, bat friends are going to be back? I don't you got, know. You I got know. the go. Harley Quinn down there. I know. We just <laughs> if you want Batman out here. I know. <laughs> yeah. 
Got some more down over this way this time. Last race, I think we only had a couple cars over here. Looks like we got several more tonight. It was not a bad little turnout. Keep in mind though, this is a two day race. Dang wind again. It's time on the back side of three and four now. I don't like finding stuff like that back here. Just because if a car comes over the road, they could run over that and it could give them some kind of issues. So we try to help out the track crew and throw the stuff back here out of the way near the tires so it's hopefully less likely to get tangled up and mess up in a car. We try to have fun, but we do try to do it with some safety in mind, so. So it makes some of these sports so fun. You can get wild and crazy, but still do it with some, some resemblance of safety. So there's three and four. If we go and we come down over this way you can see how much narrower this exit is compared to two over there this one's much narrower but they did try to make this bigger I think a couple years ago they did try making it bigger in here So there's been your walk in the pits for April 8th. Sorry about the wind. I know it's been kind of a pain in the rear. Unfortunately, I can't control the weather. Believe me, if I could, it'd be days kind of like this, but not quite so breezy. But anyways, so stay tuned. I think I might just do the walk in the pits this way and just try to get them to release the day of the race, hopefully. Um, <laughs> anyways, I don't know where I was at. One of the guys in the uh, pack truck was saying I need to get a drone out here. Honestly, I would love to get a drone, but with my vision, I'm kind of leery and to try practicing I've gotten some cheap like hundred dollar drones off Amazon and I've tried practicing with those but they're so small that like this much wind no way you couldn't fly them you couldn't even get them off the ground so it's kind of tricky being able to find drones to be able to run out here I would love to be able to I would kind of rather find somebody that would be a little bit better at doing it just because of my vision issues just because trying to fly a drone with cars that are racing for kind of money yeah so if somebody knows somebody that's actually seriously good at it hey I'd be willing to get a, try to get a hold of them and figure something out but so that's been your walk through the pits today so hope you guys enjoyed it Stay tuned for the uh, actual class green flag racing to release throughout the week. Um, I do try to get it to release generally a class a day. So I try to do Monday minis on Mondays, stocks Tuesdays, so on and so forth. So, okay, I don't know what's going on there. But anyways, we'll hopefully see you guys next time. Until the next time, keep me shiny side up.